planet Earth is under attack by creepy creatures from another world and our only hope for survival is a renegade group of martial arts experts in this exclusive first look at the sequel, Mortal Kombat Annihilation. The fights are all, I think, bigger and better than, than last time. E.T. was there for all the kicks and flips as these highly specialized superheroes did battle. But even the most agile athlete couldn't prevent the occasional accident. I got whacked where I was like, I saw stars. <laughs> Sometimes just can't help it, but you know, you might hit someone. But all you can do is apologize and say sorry. These defenders of the Earth each possess their own unique powers, from extra sensory perception to making the ground tremble. I wear some cybernetic strength enhancers. I can hit the ground and, and cause earthquakes. She can control things. She can play with things. She can do whatever she likes to do. But with all that supernatural strength, it's hard to choose the best of the bunch. You just have to watch the movie, see who is the toughest. But I think I am. Jax is a special, forge, special forces guy. Um, he wears cybernetic strength enhancers. Cybernetic strength enhancers takes what you have and quadruples the muscle capacity. So since Jax was already hardcore and tough, he's four times as tough now with the cybernetic strength enhancers. That means I could probably rip you in half with these on. There's two different realms. There's the outworld realm and then there's the earth realm. The earth realm is where we are right now. Um, some mean bad guys from the outworld, they want to come and take over the earth's realm in order to make it like their place. Um, Sonya Blade, who is also a special forces um, person, she comes back to Earth, or she is sent back to Earth, to get her partner, me, Jax, in order for us to go and fight for the Earth's freedom. Sonia Blade is a really strong warrior who, um, throughout the whole movie, tries to sort of put things back into the right place and, and cope with a couple of losses that she's had in her life. And uh, she's somebody who doesn't really show her emotions. She doesn't wear it on her sleeve. And she's very strong and she's a leader and she fights for what she believes in. It's always in a good story. You've got the good and the bad. And we're the good and the bad is Outworld. And Outworld is trying to take over Earth. And it takes it over bit by bit and everything starts to disappear and everything starts to get really dreary and sad. And we have to make sure that Earth survives and that we can save it. It is more action than in the first one. Um, I think that the part that I'm playing has become much more physical than in the first one, which I think is great, a lot of fun. You know, it's not very often that women can portray really strong roles and can actually be very physical, and I think that's great, and it's a wonderful opportunity. Dang, dang, dang. Yeah. What's up, little mom? Action! Jax! Sonya! Luke! You know this dude? Yeah. 
You cut it. I think maybe, how, how is, Sorry. um, how is your wheat? Was it, is Keep dynamic it up, is, uh, one second. pretty good. Okay. Dave, do some sign your blade. Major Jackson Briggs, you've got an incredible set of legs. For kicking, I mean. Where's Katana? She was kidnapped. By Sportsman. You lost Katana and you picked up her? She helped me get here. You ask me, your judgment sucks. Well, thanks to you, we've got Khan's extermination squad on our butt. Can I make a suggestion here? Let's put this petty crap aside, start worrying about bigger things, like staying alive. Action, you know this dude? Yeah. Is that Jax? Of course, yeah. Who the hell is she? Hey, you can sign blade. Yeah, 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 Seven Quincy, take two. Good breathing. Ready? Shh. Action. He's not here either. Yep. 47 kilo, take two. Ready? Action. He's not here either. So we just gonna wait for this dude to show? With the raider and hopeless. He's not here either. So we just gonna wait for this dude to show? Robin! Well, thanks to you, we've got Khan's extermination squad on our butt. And ready and again. Good things always uh, will win, you know? Like, we have to save this world. We have to put our good energy and love each other. This is the only way how we can survive. And this is basically um, uh, this movie uh, is all about. And I think this is great by doing martial arts it's uh, not only movements and fighting it's really about spiritual things and that's what we try to, to send to, to everybody <laughs> <laughs>